that away. To sinkhole. To sinkhole that, that way. That was a sinkhole that we just saw. Oh, there's no water in it. <laughs> well, not every sinkhole is going to have water in it. Why is it called a sinkhole then? Well, because it's a hole that that's sunk in silly. doesn't mean it has water in it. That's silly. I'm like, move it, move it. <laughs> she was singing. seating so they've kind of moved it to the other terrace to actually open up more outdoor seating okay. because you know it's such a beautiful time right now <laughs> <laughs> yeah. um, so it does definitely kind of put a like you know a little situation like how are we going to handle this but yes we can get snow um typically taking you to the end of the property because I like to show people like how big we truly are yeah. um, being on 70 acres you know we are kind of spread out you will see some homes right here so these are private homes they're not part of our rental pool so we don't have any access to them other than they're part of our homeowners association you know, on property so you know kind of spread out so you really get that feeling of being by yourself uh, we've actually I've actually had people like shop Again, it's so funny. It's like it's been so long since I actually got a light. You got 320 and you've got 220. So for right now, if you are calling and running a room and you're only, you know, a couple people, you don't want a big room, we're either gonna, you know, propose one with a king or one with two queens. Now, all of these rooms were um, reimagined uh, just this past. We completed all of the rooms remodel in February. So really changing out the um, chairs, um, some of the really see. So right now, this is showing oh, wow. as a one bedroom suite. Um, but te technically, that door would be closed. And this would be separate. That one would be separate if you wanted it to separate. Gotcha. And does this fold and fold back? It can. <laughs> yeah, it absolutely can. So if you did want to use this as just the kind of the thing I always like to point out is, of course, in the studios, it's just a shower. Gotcha. Because um, it is just a shower. And so, um, so this is connected to two queens, and on the other side you have the one king. So all of our rooms are pretty, all of our casitas are pretty similar. One side has two queens, 
studio, and then you have the one chain shop. And as you can see, again, you have your nice little private set, which doesn't have the girl though. This does not, but we do have girls. So if you were in this room and you saw that dining in the raw, and you're like, oh my gosh, I'd love to, you know, cook my own meal, mm -hmm. we will bring our grill. Oh, cool. And bring it out here for you. So Thank don't you. let that deter you. Uh, <laughs> I always tell people we absolutely can accommodate putting a grill on one of these decks for you as well. So you can cook. Yeah. And I, I think we'll see a lot of that being a lot of popular, you know, right away. People yeah. like wanting to stay in. Yeah, yeah let's just do one really meal while we're inside. In I like that yeah. the water bottles are yeah. like this. So this is really considered our standard room. So, you know, for a standard room, it's very nice size, very spacious. This does have a tub shower, obviously. Plus certain items, and then we'll come and stock the mini bar to your preference. Okay. So that way they don't feel like somebody's been handling something sure. prior to them getting here. About the kids camp, the kid camp is right here. So that gate, that door right there puts you right into Camp Coyote. Um, and then of course you've got your pool. So you can kind of see, you know, this is this is kind of the heart. This is right in the middle of the property is um, our clubhouse. Oh, please let me know if you need me to stop. <laughs> oh no, you're good. Um, and then of course we do have laundry facilities here. And this is off, obviously where the water stations are too, is throughout the casitas. Um, up in the um, in this area as well, we have the flow stations for the water bottles. But you can see, so tennis. Um, we do have our tennis pro here as well. Tennis pro. Yeah. We went into um, all the junior suites are kind of located in this area, and we have forty. Um, you do have a fireplace, so all of these rooms, no matter what room you come into, is going to have a fireplace. Okay. Whereas the studios were the only ones that had fireplaces. Um, small, you know, obviously a little area where you can sit. You've got the two TVs, so one in the living room, one in the bedroom. It's a beautiful bathroom, yes. separate tub shower, and then of course your deck. You gotta get the bathroom in here. <laughs> <laughs> it's grandiose. It's like that dream, right? Yeah. <laughs> oh, is the bathroom pretty yeah. spectacular? Oh my gosh. Yeah, it's, it's pretty nice. Wow. I like that. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It is. It, it really is. I mean, these are beautiful rooms, too. We yeah, love these rooms as well. Are the, the casitas more popular? Really great for, for couples. Um, even even couples that have a smaller children that maybe don't want the two queens. Sure. Because you can always put your kid on, on the couch. Yeah, that makes sense. So. Yeah. I like it. Are these Six to noon so people can access the fitness center. Okay. Uh, but that's really the only reason it's open. Um, it does have a restaurant, Miyamo Cafe, um, and that is open for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. So once this opens up, absolutely, okay, yes, absolutely. So once we open back up, yes, um, and even before it can, I guess we can over here uh, get a treatment if they want, um, use any of the facilities. Vortex is right there. He's usually on that mountain though, right there, like the smaller one. I think I see him climbing down. Wow. Yeah, I think he's climbing down. But he was up there. He was playing. I heard him, so I think he's climbing down. But he'll sit up there for that hours and play his flute. How old? And he hollowed out a log, put his daughter in the log. When the great flood came, it wiped out the his Native American people. And then she actually ended up at the base of Boynton Canyon, made with the sun gods, and the Native American culture was reborn. So that is like basically the mother of the Native American community is Kachina. Woman. Ooh. And that is her. Okay.